clusters of wildfires continue to rip through Northern California and Anaheim, propelled by powerful winds and dry conditions. Seventeen fires are currently charring more than 220,000 acres across the region, leaving at least 31 dead. The Tubbs fire has burned through 34,000 acres and is currently 25% contained, while the Atlas Peak fire, now 48,000 acres strong, has 27% containment. The nearby Nuns fire, which has destroyed 14,000 acres, is 5% contained and is part of a complex which includes the Pocket, Adobe, Norbaum and Presley fires. How did this happen? The fires began Sunday and grew within a matter of hours, prompting thousands to flee. Some of the largest blazes have burned through through Sonoma, Mendocino and Napa counties in Northern California. The speed of the blaze took fire officials by surprise, burning through 20,000 acres in 12 hours on Monday night. Further south, residents of Anaheim Hills and Orange County were also forced to evacuate as a brush fire, now 25% contained, burned through 7,500 acres and destroyed 24 structures. The intensity of the Napa firestorm over a span of a few hours make it one of the worst in the state's history. Though the cause of these fires aren't yet known, research continues to find human activity to blame for a majority of nationwide fires. From leftover campfires to wayward fireworks, it is said that up to 84% of fires are human-caused. What's the damage? Officials told media outlets at least 17 people died in the fires and more than 1,500 homes and business have been destroyed. As of Monday, more than 100 people were also injured by the fires, officials told CNN. Most patients were treated for smoke inhalation. The destroyed businesses include at least two wineries in Napa and Sonoma counties, the Associated Press reported. Santa Rosa, home to 175,000 people, saw some of the worst damage. Some residents told the New York Times they couldn't even find the street to their neighborhood once the fire had burnt through the area. Sonoma County Sheriff Robert Giordano reported Thursday that the total number of missing persons had reached 900, although some may be duplicate reports, and 437 have been found safe. Cell service problems are fueling the number of missing persons reports. What officials are saying an aerial photo of the devastation left behind from the North Bay wildfires north of San Francisco, California. Photo by California Highway Patrol Golden Gate Division Hanout. Cal Fire Incident Commander on Bravo told reporters in a Tuesday morning press conference in Mendocino County that the situation is dynamic and called for residents of the area to be prepared for evacuation as conditions continue to evolve. I just don't want you guys to believe that this fight is done, cause it's not, Bravo said. We've got a lot of work left to do. Amy Head, spokesperson for Kill Fire told The Guardian that this multiplicity of fires is unprecedented, adding that the majority of the fires started within the same period of time Sunday evening. It's not under control by any means, California Governor Jerry Brown said of containment efforts Tuesday. Why it's important October is considered Northern California's worst month of the fire season due to the combination of dry conditions and heavy winds, or Diablo winds that are a hallmark of the area. Heather Williams, spokesperson for Kill Fire, said an active rainy season provided an abundance of vegetation that proceeds to dry out around this time of year. Dry plants provide fuel for fires to grow quickly, especially when strong winds can carry flames over larger distances rapidly. The western U.S. has experienced a record fire season this year with nearly 40 active fires engaging more than 4,000 fire personnel nationwide, according to the latest report from the National Interagency Coordination Center. As of last month, fire suppression costs exceeded $2 billion for 